Instagram to let people know that her and uh, baby daddy are on talking terms. Yes. Um, so this came after she said that they both uh, went to file a suit against um, uh, Mujak. Mujaku. Remember the yeah. presenter who was saying that uh, the son is his? Yes. So they came together to file a lawsuit against him to tell him to like stop lying. But he did um, put out a press, co a press conference, you know, apologizing and saying all of that stuff. International went on to say, yes, he's admitted to his mistakes and we have decided to forgive him. Yes, and she went on to explain that her and Diamond are now on talking terms. She said because of their child, they need to be on talking terms, and she has a lot of respect for him. And he actually did share a video of yeah. Tanasha's um, nephew, was it nephew or niece? Yeah. Nephew dancing to his, uh, his song, and he went on to share on his uh, Instagram saying, thank you, Tanasha, for sharing this with me, and we do have a video. All right. Okay. Mm -hmm. On the okay. Oh. Yeah, it was actually the news. Sorry, my bad. My English is confused. <laughs> yes, <the> news. <laughs> I think it's contagious. <laughs> Which <laughs> news do you need? I don't know what's going on. Nejo Mikali is playing victim, but mm -hmm. she's the genesis wow. of this situation. Wow. What, what are you just talking about? Just talk about the revelation inside. Let's just talk about Zali. 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 just like we'll be here watching. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> what are you trying to say? You know, I can imagine you you have a kid with someone, and then okay, in this situation, both of them are like um, public figures, mm. and then you're not able to talk to your partner. Yeah. yeah. Where's it? Una just frustrated because maybe you're seeing news on the blogs, mm. and you're not even able to like ask, you know, like where, what's up? As in, what am I seeing? What yeah. am I hearing? Because you know, like it's the same thing. People are going to fabricate stories. Yeah. But a blog, the diamond says this about Tanasha, but in the real sense, he didn't say it. <laughs> yeah. And Tanasha is here. I'm a job. Sababu funonu ziko online. Yeah. And here it will. Please talk. Talk. Oh, I mean, and for this, I, no? they say it's for the sake of the child, so. Yeah, so. Eh, let's, let's, conditions. Let's, 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 anyway, talking talk. about talking, eh? So, there's a certain guy by the name Steve Stanalias. I think that's how the second name is pronounced. And he's a former bodyguard to Kim and Kim Kardashian and Kanye West. So, the guy was on a radio interview. No, yes, a podcast interview. Um, The Hollywood Raw podcast. And he was heard talking about, you know, um... Back in 2016, before he resigned from being a bodyguard to the power couple, he decided to leave, but he was now talking about them and, you know, the things like he experienced working for them. And what came into attention was when he said, um, Kanye West is needy, like among all the celebrities he's been with. <laughs> he's needy. Ah, you he lie. has ridiculous rules, yes. And... He's a very moody person and also yeah. he doesn't like it when someone when he's walking he needs you to be like 10 steps behind so that you Aye. don't block any shots just in case a paparazzi is over there trying to get a shot so it's alleged okay so what happened um this guy switched from being a bodyguard to now doing acting and directing and he has a publicist by the name zach tapperman who um they have been working like together in his new film that is about to drop and it was actually supposed to be launched i think june 3rd is it today or yesterday or tomorrow so yeah and baby ni hype kidogo but he was like there's no point of you like dropping a lawsuit of 10 million dollars because of he, him talking about things that are back in the day like way back and yeah way back when is it yeah we are really kwa kwa needy yeah only back kwa needy what i'm honestly really? not surprised I'm not imagine i'm not shocked can you west is weird man he's just a weird, weird. guy though i think he's weird, like, yeah. moody yes i think he is he but comes moody off. goes hand in hand with you being needy needy, needy. I don't no know. it doesn't go hand, hand and in hand. funny funny rules you know have you ever, like, yeah, he has very him? funny yeah. rules. Like I'm even got like Kim clothes. Kardashian yeah. to change how she used to dress. Oh. Yeah, that was crazy. Though. Wearing at him more neutral colors, <laughs> and also telling her he doesn't feel comfortable when she do when she takes just just certain pictures. I'm like, excuse me, what? Ten steps, ten steps. Uska block 
paparazzi akiwa hapo wow. that guy is weird. that I guy know, there's a so time weird. yeah when he was when he was recording allegedly when he was i don't know if he was recording an album he was busy like you know during that that summer it's really like three months yeah. he added so much weight and because he didn't want to be seen in public and be ridiculed for like adding weight he went and got liposuction what seriously yeah he did that's how weird he is that's My so weird. God. Yeah. Hey. Like they're just they're He's a weird guy. Me everything the bodyguard is saying, it's not it doesn't come as a surprise to yeah. anyone. So I don't know why Kanye West is like trying to sue him. We know you're weird. It's fine. Yeah. But they have they're like <laughs> if he does it again, ten million dollars. But like, she does a first one. He doesn't even need to say anything.